It's an unfair but, I think, incontrovertible fact that when an artist makes consistently good records, people, particularly rock critics, start to take them for granted. Consistency writes white. It's as if we require peaks and troughs, departures, disasters, comebacks to keep us interested. Which brings us to Mogwai, who started making great albums 17 years ago and forgot to stop. Rave Tapes is their eighth album, their 15th if you count live albums, remix collections and film soundtracks, of which they've proved to be quite spectacularly adept. If you haven't already, I particularly urge you to hear their soundtrack for last year's French TV drama, The Returned. You could argue the changes it makes to their largely instrumental sound are incremental. Remurdered certainly doesn't sound like anything they've done before, not least because it is, in its own way, weirdly funky. Not, it has to be said, an adjective much associated with Mogwai in the past. But elsewhere, it sounds like a band honing rather than overhauling what they do. What they're incredibly skilled at is creating a kind of tension between two opposing musical forces in a track. Repellish has a rather sweet melody, not a million miles removed from something Boards of Canada might come up with, but it's set against the recording of someone complaining about hidden satanic messages in Led Zeppelin records. Further in the tape, I came across another part that made me throw my headphones right off my head. I couldn't believe what I heard. No Medicine for Regret takes a beautiful little keyboard figure and throws it into the middle of a blizzard of scourging guitar noise. Elsewhere, it surges and soars, ebbs and flows. Listening to it is an immersive experience. It's often really moving, as on the hymn-like closer, The Lord is Out of Control. contains a track called Simon Ferocious, which Queen fans will know is the name by which Freddie Mercury imperiously addressed Sid Vicious when he bumped into him in a studio in 1977. Ultimately, it's just another great Mogwai album, which is something I think is worth celebrating. You can stream it on SoundCloud now. The physical release is out on Monday.